Good afternoon and welcome to the 2024 Volkswagen Tiguan RLI. I've had to come outside because it's just a little bit too close to the glass for me to get uh, the right angle for you. Uh, but you can see the front just through the glass here. You can just about see the design changes. Obviously, it's a lot more streamlined and a lot more sleek looking. Got a lot more gloss black. This one's obviously got the, the black pack, so it uh, eliminates most of the chrome that would be on the car otherwise. Um, you can see the difference between this one and the old R-Line as well. Just looks a lot more sort of, more, a lot more modern. Um, I think it looks a bit slimmer, a little bit trimmed down. The black pack looks really great on these as well, which makes it look a lot sporty, a lot more aggressive. As you can see, it's a new LED light bar on the front of the car as well which runs along the whole of the, across the front of the grille like you get on the new Touareg. And it's the same for the rear as well. The LED bar running along the whole of the back of the car. Just makes it a lot more visible. Um, makes it instantly recognisable as well. This particular car has got the comfort pack. So at the touch of a button, you've got the electric tailgate, which will open for you. Uh, this car has got a much bigger boot than the previous version of the Tiguan. You've also got the multi-low uh, floor. So it's nice and flat at the moment. You can have it a bit, little bit lower as well. And that's where the spare wheel would be if you opted for one. Got 12 volt in the back there. You've got easy access to fold down the seats like you did in the previous model. LED lighting for visibility at night time as well. Brand new to the 2024 Tiguan is the addition of massage seats available in the Elegance and R-Line models, such as this There's one. There's a few different settings for the massage seats. You've got waves, you've got tapping and you've got stretching. You can change the intensity and it's for the passenger as well as the driver. You can change the duration as well, so if you're on a long journey, set it for a little bit longer. On a shorter journey, set it for a bit shorter. Very helpful, it actually decreases the fatigue as well, so it makes you a lot more sort of focused on the driving. Uh, a lot of people believe it make you fall asleep, but actually it does just relieve a bit of fatigue. You also got heated seats in this one as well, which you can operate on the screen here. This has got the infotainment pack plus as well, so you've got the bigger screen in here. Um, New to this one, you've got the, from the Golf and the ID models, you've got the uh, the touch uh, climate control, which is on this board here. This is now backlit as well, so it's easier to, to find the uh, controls, etc. cetera. Um, much easier to use than the previous one. You've got these lips between us, so you know which bit's which. And the power button is a bit further over to the side down there. So it's a lot, he, he, a lot more difficult to press by accident. The screen is also more similar to the Golf in the temperature system as well. So... Uh, you've got the multi sort of, uh, you know, multi customizable screens. You can have a different layouts, have a sat nav up on there as well. This one has also got the head up display. I'm not sure if I can get the angle to, you can just probably just about see flickering in front of me just there. Um, so head up display on this one as well. Um, which is really helpful. You keep your eyes on the road. It'll tell you the speed you should, uh, you're currently going at, um, and the speed of the road. It'll also give you directions as well. Uh, very, very helpful. As before, heated steering wheel is standard on the R-Line model, and so is the adaptive cruise control, standard in all the models. Gear stick is now up uh, on the steering wheel, so you never have to take out your hands off the steering wheel as well. It's much more convenient to press. You know, you're always very close to where you want to be. Park is just there as well. Really easy to use that, that gear stick. Ambient lighting has also been improved as well, so you've got it just in front of you there with the R logo. It looks very nice. You've also got it on doors as well. And you've also got it on this little display down here, the multi-function display, which is new to this car. And of course, the digital cockpit there as well. Just to talk to you a little bit about that button. So as I said, it's a multi-function uh, device. So it currently set to volume, so you change your volume and then you tap it down and it will change your driver profile as well. So very nice and easy to use. Um, I hope they bring this to a few more of the models as well, particularly performance models. because It's nice and easy to access the different driving modes. So that'll be... Really, really interesting to see what they do with that. Um, glasses holder as well. That's new to the uh, 24 Tiguan. I think they took it out of the previous one. Um, maybe if I think if you had the pan roof, it might take that away. Practicality has been improved massively. So underneath the armrest, you used to have a little tiny cup hold. You couldn't put a great amount of it into it. But uh, now you've got two extra cup holders down there, as well as the uh, ones down here, which you can fully customize where you want all these things as well. Again, making the most of the space that there is on, on this pit, you can put whatever you like. And then underneath, you've got mobile, um, wireless mobile charging for two devices now as well. So your driver and your passenger. Very nice, him and hers. So with the black pack, you'll get these 20 inch York alloy wheels. They look absolutely fantastic. Really nice and sporty, nice and aggressive. You also get the uh, gloss black trim on the wheel arch as well. Um, you get the black roof rails and the gloss black mirrors gloss back pretty much everywhere like i said the big gloss back black at the front as well and also one final point this car's got the iq lights as well which is 
the very uh, in, much improved LED lights, really nice and visible, nice bright, small LEDs as well, makes the car instantly recognisable. Um, and it also means you've got much stronger LEDs at the front as well. Really good for your night driving. Thank you very much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, if you'd like to arrange a test drive to, uh, to test drive the new Tiguan, please let me know. Or if you'd like any more information, again, you've got my contact details in this email. Thanks so much. My name's Liam. Happy to help.